In this quick video, we're going to see how you can use templates to create a daily journal in RemNote. Hey everyone, welcome back to the RemNote tutorial series. If you're new here, my name is Jerzen. I am a third year medical student. A daily journal is a great way to start off your day. It's been a part of my routine for about a year now, and it's helped me bring focus to my days. When I sat down to script this video, my main goal was to talk about templates and how you can make a template, but I realized the best way to showcase it would be with an example and the best use case that I use it for is for the daily note. Now, if you know Remno, you know that it's mainly free flow writing. You just write anywhere and you write everywhere and it's helpful for connecting your notes. But this isn't really great for organizing your notes if you want to organize all your templates, for example. So to do this, I just created a page in RemNote called templates. So let's go into that page. I'm going to open it on the side. So in this page is where I create and store all my templates. So I only have one right now, the daily notes template. But if you want, you can add a lot more. There is no hard and fast rule that you have to follow. So the way I do it, creating a template is pretty simple. Since all rems, i.e. bullet points, are already pages in themselves, you can just write out a bullet point. So for example, we have the daily notes template written here and everything underneath that is basically my template for the daily note. So in a nutshell, nesting everything underneath the parent rem is going to make it into a template. Well, in this use case. Now, once you've scripted out your template, you have to convert all of them into slots and a slot is sort of like a child rem. This is a little bit of a weird analogy, but you can kind of think of it as baby ducks. A baby duck always follows a mother duck. So a slot, i.e. a child rem, is always going to follow the parent rem wherever it goes. So to tag it as a slot, you just simply hit slash and then type out slot and you can see the option called turn into a slot has appeared here. I've already done that for all of these because I do use this template on a daily basis, but you just go through all the lines of your template right here and you just tag all of them as slot. Weird analogies aside, another thing that I like to do is add the tag called automatically add template. The benefit of adding this tag is that whenever you tag the parent rem, i.e. when you're using the template, all the slots, i.e. the child rems, are going to automatically appear under the parent rem. Before this feature was added, you would have to click a little button that says show all the slots. This just makes it a little easier, a little less clicks, saves a little bit of time, and it just automates everything, which is pretty great. Right, so that's pretty much it. So now that you have your template up and ready, you can start using it. So in this case, since this is a daily note, the best place to use it would be the daily note function of RemNote. So we're gonna hit option D to go to today's note, which is March 4th. So to simply add the template, you just hit hashtag, hashtag and then you go daily note template since we are adding the daily notes template right here and we can see that it has popped up just click it and it's there and then you can just use this like you would so for example this is my morning routine so what are you grateful for i'm grateful for all the subscribers on this channel well if you haven't subscribed you can subscribe now so that's pretty much it using a template is a very powerful feature in remnote and i hope this helps you in figuring out how to use it it's not as straightforward as you might think it is but now you know. If you want to learn more about RemNote, you can check out my Absolute Basics of RemNote series right here, where I go through a lot of other features of RemNote and a lot of my own workflows with practical examples. Other than that, if you liked the video, a subscribe and a like would be awesome. And I will catch you guys in the next one. Have a great weekend. Goodbye.